So hi friends, welcome back again to the channel Eau de Parfum. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe. And while you're at it, please uh, give us a thumbs up for this video. It doesn't cost anything, it is for free. And it just uh, helps the video, helps the channel. So uh, yes, without further ado, the unboxing and first impressions ever for me, personally, for this fragrance right here. Uh, this is called Al Sayyad by the company Art Al Zafaran that we have the logo right here on the box, also on the back. Um, it is an EDP concentration and it comes in a 100 ml size bottle. Uh, it is a fragrance for men. Um, I heard a lot of things about it. I never smelled it, but I heard that it smells uh, like Invictus by Paco Rabanne, like it is a Middle Eastern version of uh, Invictus. And, other and others have said that this one smells a lot like uh, Hawas by uh, Rasasi. And um, those, I think those same people have said that uh, maybe since Hawass became uh, a much uh, expensive fragrance than how it used to be a while ago, this one can be like a cheaper alternative, especially that this one comes with a really uh, affordable price tag. Um, around, I would say like around uh, 18 until like $28. Uh, it depends on the seller, but it doesn't really cross that $28, $29 price uh, tag. Or price mark so uh, yes without further ado let's uh, open the box let's unbox it and get the bottle outside the box so yeah I uh, took uh, the cellophane off I opened the box this is the bottle I'm gonna put it uh, to the side because I want to show you uh, the box so as you can see right here this is the box and it has this certain logo right here I don't know if you guys can see it very well we have the name of the fragrance right here in English and in Arabic it says for men uh, EDP concentration 100 ml uh, size and uh, on the top we have the Art Al Zafran logo and we have this really nice design and it has a nice feel as well on the bottom we have uh, the the production date and expiration date we have more information the barcode made in UAE and also we have the usual stamp for the authentication this hologram type of stamp and right here also once again uh, the, the logo once again uh, of Art Al Zafran right here uh, once again the name of the fragrance the ingredients and more information as you can see this is the the box from a further angle and uh, once again the base the bottom of the box the top and uh, yeah i showed you the face of the box i like uh, about this box that it has this sort of sleeve that you can take uh, take off if you want and uh, once again it shows you the name of the fragrance right here and once again uh, that uh, logo i really really like the design and uh, the let's call it the decoration and the um, yeah, the design is really really nice and I like the colors black with red. It's really really nice And uh, yeah, we took already we took the the bottle outside the and for the bottle. It's really uh, Beautiful to be honest with you. This is one of the the most beautiful bottles uh, from Art Al Zafran, you know, really uh, these Middle, e Middle Eastern houses they really deserve uh, to be checked out uh, as you can see over here on the on the cap we have like some sort of ruby type of uh, stone and it's uh, adding to the beauty of the the bottle the tube inside is also in a red color which uh, which works very well with the, the black design on the back it's getting a bit dark in here I hope uh, mother nature can give me two minutes just you know just two minutes so I can try this fragrance please all right so uh, yeah, let's see how it sprays like and let's see how it smells like i'm gonna spray it on my hand all right two sprays very nice sprayer by the way this spray is really good oh very very nice and the cap this is class in a bottle to be honest with you all right let's smell this fragrance yeah Invictus right away. So Invictus -y. I don't even get the the Middle Eastern vibe that some people I don't get that uh, Middle Eastern vibe that some people uh, claimed uh, that this fragrance has. But maybe it shows up later in the dry down. And for the opening, this is Invictus right away. Like no doubt. 
there is uh, yeah definitely some sort of um, grapefruit with tangerine a little bit citrusy in the beginning a slight saltiness as well if I can say that and there is definitely a marine accord here and it smells really nice it smells really nice it has also uh, I can say it has this uh, bubble gummy vibe a little bit not too much it's just a little bit it does definitely smell like Hawass as well you know Hawass smells a lot a lot like Invictus but um, it doesn't really smell uh, that much like the the aqua I mean it doesn't have that uh, that vibe like the Invictus aqua but it's more towards the, the regular Invictus with a with a let's say it this way with a much more uh, marine or like also watery Accords. Well, it smells really, really nice, and uh, for that price tag, uh, this is extraordinary. I mean, the resemblance with Invictus Park Rabanne is uh, so big. I'm so sure if I spray Invictus Park Rabanne in the other hand, I will not really tell the difference. And it does. I mean, let me say it this way: it does. I mean, this one, it does have that feel like it is an EDP concentration as it says on the box it does feel like an EDP it has that sort of uh, dense vibe accord if you can call it an accord and uh, it smells really nice I like it so far I will have to wear it a few times uh, give it a few wearings for a few days and uh, come back to you guys with my full review for this fragrance right here this is Al Sayyad by Art Al Zafran it is for men and it is mind-blowing how it smells so much like Invictus Park Raban. Yeah, so uh, yes, give us a thumbs up for the video if you're not subscribed. Make sure to subscribe and stay tuned for the next videos. Take care. Bye.